Hey everyone, David C. Anderson here coming at you from the Knife Center. And today we're taking a look at the Benchmade Crooked River series of folding knives. Let's check them out. With the Crooked River, Benchmade has asked the question, what if the classic folding hunter was designed today? Clean sheet from the ground up. Well, you'd probably get something like this. It's a smooth opening knife with a fancy lock and premium material. So let's take a look at what makes it so special. The blade itself hews pretty closely to the classic formula in that it's a long clip point shape, about four inches of length. If that's just a little more than you'd want to carry, however, they also have a smaller version of this knife called the Mini Crooked River, which comes in at a little bit under three and a half inches. The steel in either case is S30V, which is going to give you plenty of edge retention, and it has a stonewashed finish, which is a great working option. It's going to help to hide scratches because they're kind of going to blend into the natural random pattern that is there. We get a mid-height flat grind, gives us decent slicing abilities, and plenty of strength behind it for heavier outdoor work as well. In keeping with the classic aesthetic, the handles feature an aluminum bolstered look with inlays. You can get it with gray G10 inlays, as well as this diamond wood version, which really leans into the old school vibe. Now, diamond wood is a stabilized wood product that uses natural materials, and it's not as susceptible to warping, shrinking, or cracking as standard wood can be. But of course, you can always go with that G10 option if you want even more durability. But both are set off nicely by some orange accents. We've got an anodized pivot collar around the pivot screw, as well as a nice crenellated G10 backspacer. Now this full-size knife has a very roomy handle. Even in my slightly larger hands, you can see I have a full extra finger length left over. That's going to make it great if you do happen to have very large hands, you're going to have plenty of length. But even if you don't have the largest hands, that's going to give you plenty of room if you need to wear work gloves so you can still get a full grip. The Mini Crooked River is a bit smaller, although I'd still say it's plenty big enough. I can still get comfortably all four of my fingers on the handle with no overhang. All of these knives feature Benchmade's signature axis lock, a smooth and strong mechanism. This crossbar style lock features, you guessed it, a crossbar that runs through the handle with springs that keep it locked against the tang of the knife. This lock is very easy to disengage with one hand, and you can even flick it open and closed by holding it back and twisting your wrist. Like any Axis lock knife, this is a great option for lefties too, since there's nothing at all that's biased to just right-handed use. It's easy locking from either side, and we also get a reversible black finished pocket clip, as well as dual thumb studs that make this knife a willing dance partner for nearly anyone. When it comes to picking the right version of this knife for you, that's where it gets a little bit interesting. Now, even though they call the smaller version a mini, it's still a fairly large knife. It's almost as big as a standard size Benchmade Griptilian. And for me, this would be a great size for EDC. You can get all your stuff done without having too much extra length, but it's still big enough that you're gonna be able to do some larger jobs too. And honestly, at this size, I think it would even hunt well too. But if you're looking to tackle bigger game, or you need more length in your day-to-day -day use, or you're just looking for a full-size folder for camping, hiking, or bushcraft, then this large size is going to be a great option. Be sure to let us know what you think of these knives down in the comments, and to get your hands on one of your own, click the link in the description below to head over to KnifeCenter.com. Cool. Monday's a state of mind. Can't use that. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Can't, Can't use that. that. <laughs> Can't use that. You're just, gonna, you're just gonna cut together all the times I say, Can't use that. Can't use that. Can't use that. Yeah. <laughs> I was in trouble like three words into that. <laughs>